guys, girls, non-binary people. Straight here yet again. People with us today, we got the box in the back as our sidekick. We also have with us today, people, we have everybody's favorite ass. It's double A, it's A double S, J W. We got Alexa. You like Butterfinger candy bar. I don't have an opinion. You don't on have that. an opinion on that. We're about to find out, people, because today it looks like it's that time. It's time for another exciting, insane, super official, thought provoking, straight edge food product review from YouTube's only true 365 day a year food product review. Now, people, not only are we reviewing the brand new and improved Butterfinger, it says right here, we have the original Butterfinger. So, I have the original and the new. Now, this is still, uh, is it out of date? I don't think it is. Let me look right quick. But anyway, guys, oh, here it is. It says May 2019. It says best by end of May 2019. So, I made sure that when I reviewed these, I thought to myself, this has been getting requested a lot, so that's why I did it. But I thought, I've got to review them side by side. So this one will be disappearing, and this is going to be the new one. We're going to see if it's better. Now this one was bigger. I don't know why. $199, $150. But the main thing is we're going to see which one is better. Right? You know, if my ex-wife saw this right now, she would say, well, this one's better because it's bigger. You know, because the ex-wife, it's like she said, it's always, it's, she said it's bigger the better. Just like the night I walked in on her, she got 12 inches deep inside of her. She said Malcolm found places that she didn't know existed. Anyway, I can get into it. I can get into it. I'm sorry. We're going to give this a review. Uh, we have our palate cleanser today, coming in Gap Water. We're going to see what it's all about. So, as always, guys, remember if you have that like read box lecture, you got to leave a comment below if you like, pick it out, review request next. Thumbnail, new and improved, just like the ex wife said about Malcolm's 12 inch BBC. Okay, guys, first up, we're going to take a sip of water here and get the palate cleansed. And we're going to see what we've got. Now, what we're going to do, people, is we're going to start with the new and improved Butterfinger first. That's what it says. I mean, I've not looked at anybody online that's uh, reviewed them or compared them. This is the first time I've tried it or... Uh, I'm not researched it. There we go. So let's put our towels right here in case there's any crumbs. And let's get right to it. Here we go. We're going to slowly eat this. Really get the full flavor of it. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure, people. Let's get with the original here now. I'll tell you one thing I can notice right now. Seems like the flavor is a little bit different. It really is. So here's the original Butterfinger. The one you grew up with. The one we saw on The Simpsons. It even smells different. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh my God. We have a problem on our hands, people. I mean, there's no doubt about it. I'm sorry. I'm not going to be totally judgmental right now, but the 
the improved recipe is not as good as the original. I mean, wow. Okay, back to the original here. The improved, I'm sorry. We're gonna take one more bite each, just to make sure. We're gonna get right to it, but I'll tell you right now. We'll see, there we go. That's good. Wow. Boy. It's like a different candy bar, really. I mean, it's still good. It is. Wow. That's good. That is good. Hmm. It's a battle right here, people. This is, uh, that first bite, I wasn't sure, but after the second bite right there, you can really taste it. Wow. It's got a different taste. It really does. It's different. Wow. All right, guys, take one more bite of the original Butterfinger. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Alrighty, guys, it's pretty obvious. Um, now, <clears throat> the problem I have with the candy bar improved recipe. Um, I guess it's because it has no artificial flavors is what it is. It's uh, gluten-free, no artificial flavors. But I will be honest with you 100% people. This right here, which is almost out of date, and it's not fresh. I mean, you can taste it. It's still very good, but you can tell it's not 100% fresh. The original Butterfinger is better than the improved one. It's just a sorry, but it's true. It's close. But... There's just more flavor. There's just more in the original. The improved is good, okay? But you can clearly taste the difference. Seems like the flavors in the original are just stronger, more potent, a little bit. Uh, and I realize this one probably, let's see, no, well, this has no artificial flavors or colors. So the original says this right here, but it, this one's gluten-free, I guess, is the main difference. And I guess they may have changed the recipe. I don't know. Made with real peanut butter, made with real peanut butter. So they've come out with the new candy bar. And while it will pass as, of course, very good, the original is better. So I would say, actually, if you was going to compare them head-to-head, -head, you would give this... The slight edge, the original is better. And I don't know if it's a slight edge really, but it's just a, it's just more fulfilling. And uh, it just tastes better. So there you have it. Even though they say it's improved recipe, the original is still the better, the better candy bar. And that's, that is the honest truth from someone who grew up eating Butterfinger candy bars. Yeah. Alexa, when was Butterfinger candy bar invented? Butterfinger is something that was invented in 1923. Wow. I wonder how many times the recipe's changed since then, though. You know it's changed over the years. It's essentially, it's essentially the same candy bar. 
And I don't know if they say it's gluten-free and healthier. I mean, it's a candy bar. It's a candy bar. Let's be real. <laughs> Let's look at the nutritional facts and see if that's different. Well, there's probably no reason to look because one candy bar is bigger than the other anyway, so it's not really going to compare. 240 calories, 250. Uh, no, really, there's no real reason to look at it because one candy bar is just bigger than the other anyway, so. So that's going to be the official review, people. The original Butterfinger is still the best, even though it's going to disappear now. This one is not as fresh. I also remember that. This is this right here is due to run out the end of May, it says. And this is, uh, what, middle of May, something like that. So, there you have it. And this is good until September 2019. So, there you have it, people. That is still better. And that's the 100% truth. So, there you go, Nestle. I, I know what you've, I respect what you've tried to do or whatever and tried to improve it, but the original is still better. It is. So that's the official review as always. Thank you so much for watching. As always, made the box. Alexa, we're going to see you guys tomorrow. Give the video a like. You know, we really, we really would appreciate it. So we continue our quest to be the number one food product reviewer on YouTube. And I've not done any research. Like I said, I've not looked at any comparisons. I don't know nothing about it. I've just went into this. You know, my mind was not clouded by people saying this and this about it. I've just heard that there's a new Butterfinger on the market, and I reviewed it. So that's going to be it, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. Me, the box Lex. We're going to see you guys tomorrow. Thumbs up it. Have a great day. Toodles. Beautiful. We got everything in here, people. We got lettuce, guacamole, cheese, nachos, beef, tomatoes. How many kinds of cheese? Two different kinds of cheese. Sour cream. Mm. Oh my God. You really can't eat it all, people. This is only for a limited time. Um, I know where you guys better go today. You better go to Taco Bell and get you some processed food. Look at that. You can't eat it all. It's not possible. It's just not possible. There's too much of it to handle. Look at that. Mmm.